and I think the way this fest has been run, it's almost better than anything I've seen in Australia mm. for years. Yeah. Like, we were talking to people before, and it's as good as the stuff we were going to as kids. I think all these new festivals that popped up and they're trying new things, trying new things, trying new things, you know, there's always going to be complainers and everything like that, but this one, I've only seen positivity. Yeah. Every band playing, seeing a sea of people that we see on the videos from Europe festivals, from American festivals. Mm. Now Australia's got that. Yeah. Now Australia's got the sea of people and it's insane. Yeah, and I think coming out of even what everyone's been through in the last couple of years, like obviously globally it's been... I don't like to harp on about it. It's been, like, terrible. But yeah, as musicians yeah. as well, like, this is the livelihood. Like, capture the moment when you guys could get back yeah. on stage for the first time after the years we do not talk about. Yeah, yeah. we spent years thinking it was never going to come back. Like, we'd spent a whole year, a whole life aiming for something like this, like this past weekend. And it obviously felt like we had that taken away from us. And yeah. we persevered. We stayed busy. We were hopeful. And here we are. Yeah. Not fest 2023. On that, it, like, we weren't having a lot of luck with Australian fests anyway. Like, we'd done some smaller ones here and there. We did Full Tilt, whatever. But we played the inside stage at Full Tilt, which is just, like, still a massive festival, but, like, it doesn't count, man. Like, so being outside at, like, a gigantic festival where there's literally, like, an endless sea of people yeah. has been, like, all right, this is, like, we waited this long for this and it's worth it, you yeah. know? Like, Yeah. Yeah, well, it's like what you kind of touched on. It's like the festivals that we all kind of remember and like everyone, you know, like yeah. we had. Yeah, someone said it felt, felt like Soundwave. Yes. And I was just like, yeah, actually. Yeah. And I know you kind of captured that a little bit, but like what, as increasingly bigger staples of the Aussie heavy industry or scene, I hate to use the word scene, but, you know, let's call it what it Fine. is. But like, what do you guys see as something like this as an opportunity like to present to the heavy community? Like, what does this mean to have something like this in Australia? It's, it's funny because... We write our music with stuff like today in mind. We want these crazy moments and to be able to perform the songs that we wrote, wrote a long time ago now, yeah. it feels like a long time ago, and to get the response that we had an idea for and see it executed to its maximum potential, it's mind-blowing. Yeah. It's mind-blowing and it's paid everything off for us. Like It's a breath of fresh air. All the stress, all the pain, like... It's paid off. It's, yeah. it's incredible. 